morning everyone. Uh, me and George have come out fishing again today. Uh, we're supposed to be going to home farm fisheries. Uh, but when we got there this morning, uh, the lake was still frozen over. I thought it had been melting this morning, but with all the mild weather we, we had last night, but uh, it was still frozen. So we've decided to pop along to Oak Island in Crew. Um, cracky little pool, we've got a couple on here. Um, nothing, again, nothing major in here, but it's it gets a rod, uh, bend in the rod, which is good. There's some uh, purple carp in here. Supposedly. Some uh, But yeah, so, having a little session today. Um, I've got a friend of mine who's also joined, Tomo and his lad, Jack. So, hopefully between us all today, should be able to, should be able to get one to. Mine just beeped. Was that yours? Sure it's yours. Um, so yeah, so hopefully we'll catch one or two today. Uh, the weather's a bit better today. Uh, it's currently seven degrees, uh, and I think it's going to stay around about that all day. Uh, to be fair, which isn't too bad. Uh, but what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll keep you posted throughout the day, and uh, we'll catch you soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Update on what we're uh, what we're using today. Uh, as you can see, it's really it's sunny. It's nice. The sun's in my eyes again, like it was on my last video. Uh, but I don't mind. I'd rather have sun than rain. To be honest with you. Um, so George, uh, he's using the alarm today. Uh, he's got his car put out. He's on uh, Citrus B1 uh, in a solid bag with uh, a B1 pop-up. Um, it's always been a favourite. You like that, don't you? Yeah, like it. Like it. yeah, he's fishing uh, in the in between uh, an island, so roughly in the middle. Uh, I'm fishing on Wicked Tuna. Uh, I've always liked Wicked Tuna. It's always been a good, it's always been a good bait for me. It smells nice at all. Well, it doesn't smell now. It smells horrible, but I suppose the fish quite like it. Oh, yeah. um, fishing uh, just off, uh, just off an island. Um, and then I've got something that I've not done for a very long time. I've uh, done I'm this. Fishing. I'm fishing on a float rod as well. So we've got three rods out so uh, Using corn on that uh, because the fish vary in size uh, down here in Cricket. So uh, it'd be nice to pull out one or two, uh, one or two uh, little, little carp, see if we can get them interested. Um, we're also using quite a lot of maize, well, I've got maize and uh, particle mix. So that's going in. Uh, so I'm feeding the areas up quite well. Uh, they don't really want too much in the winter, uh, as I've been, as I've been informed. Uh, but little, little and often, uh, and then same yeah. as say we'll try and try and pull out one or two. It's eleven o'clock, so hopefully we we'll catch one for uh, a couple of hours. Next couple of hours, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Cheers, guys. We'll keep you updated. Thank you. Hey everyone, uh, I'm George. Um, I'm very new to carp fishing. Um, I want to say big thank you to Tomo who's come with us today. Uh, he's uh, donated two carp rods um, and one quiver tip rod. So, massive thank you to Tomo. I'll keep you posted. Hello everyone. Uh... A little bit of info for today, uh, where, we, where we're fishing. Uh, we're down on Okanga. There's two pools here, and then up on Walnut Tree Farm, there's a few of it, three pools. Um, they're all pretty good, uh, especially in the summertime. Your rods are never in the water that long before you, you know, you're bagging up again. Um, in, in the big pool we're down on today, it's got a massive, massive head of uh, silvers, load of perch, gudgeon roach, rod, all them, all the match fishing style uh, fish, which is nice. Um, 
there's a massive head of, 20, uh, of carp in here, sorry, uh, up to about 20 pounds. Plenty of mid-teens, uh, but there is there's a few that go up to the uh, up to the mid 20s mark, which again is quite nice for a, a decent rod bend, which is really good. Um, the carp, some of the carp in here have got a, a slight tinge of purple in them, so I've been told. Uh, I've not caught one of those, but so I've been told, which would be quite nice to get. Um, I don't mind a purple carp, a bit similar to a koi. Um, also, there is a catfish in here. Only the one, so so the owner says. Uh, very rarely comes out. Yeah, I don't think he's been out in the last three or four years. Um, and we believe it's up to about the 30, 40 pound mark. I don't quite know, uh, I'm not sure. Uh, between the 20 and the 40 pound mark, uh, I, I'm not sure, but I know he's, he's in here. Um, but he doesn't come out that often. Uh, if, if it is that you do manage to grab hold of him, uh, you get uh, a year's uh, fishing for free on all of the five pools. <coughs> um, so yeah, so that'd be nice to nice to pull him, pull him out. Be lovely. Um, today's been really nice, been nice and sunny. Uh, we've not had we've had a bit of drizzle, but no, no rain really. Um, so much so I've not really had to put the brolly up. It's been it's been sort of behind me, and it's not moved all day, which has been nice. Um, still haven't had anything on the rods yet. We've got about two hours left of fishing. Uh, so hopefully, one of us can, can pull one out. We will keep trying, won't we? You better it will. Yeah, keep trying. If it takes all day, we'll keep trying. If it yeah. takes all day. Right. Cheers, guys. Okay, so, <clears throat> final little bit uh, for today. Uh, it's probably about half an hour left of fishing. Um, it's not gone, not gone to plan today. Uh, neither of us have had anything, have we? No. I don't think. I've uh, had a couple of knocks. Yeah, we've, all, we've, we've had a couple of knocks, um, but nothing, nothing on the bank, unfortunately. Uh, could be due to the weather. It has only just thawed out, so the water is. It's really, really cold, so that could that could be one of the reasons why. Um, but we're not going to give up, are we? No, no, not it's give good. Up. We'll uh, continue to keep going fishing. You've started up, and you know, so which is nice. Uh, need to learn a few more bits and bobs, and then we'll go f a few more pools. Hopefully, get some catch, get some yeah. more fi get some fish on the bank, eh? Um, so yeah, so I'm going to wrap it up here. Uh, so yeah, that's that's pretty much all we've got for this. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like and put the bell on when you know uh, when, for the notification. Sweet. Happy days. See you soon, guys. Thank you. See you.